It's not often that we get to see the impact we're making right in front of us. But in June of 2023, that's exactly what happened. When a young Houston Astros ball player shared a story with a veteran pitcher from the St. Louis Cardinals. For the first time since 1982, St. Louis has a World Series winner. In 2013, Adam led the league in wins and helped take the Cardinals back to the World Series once again. But this story is about an impact he made off the field after the season had ended. The water program we did was through Water Mission and we did a project in Honduras. I wanted to go there, experience it, drink the water, see the people, meet the people, shake their hands, ask them how it was, how it's changed their lives and, and uh, see the results. And now Mauricio Dubon enters our story. Mauricio was born in Honduras and grew up playing baseball close to where Water Mission was impacting communities in need. In Honduras, only half of all homes have access to safe, clean water. Every time we played soccer with my friends, we used to drink water out of the faucet. Out of the, we didn't know if it was clean water or, or, or it was, you know, bad water. And next thing you know, a week later, I'm having stomach problems and, and stuff like that. I went in knowing that this particular community was up on this hill and the, the residents had to walk miles down this hill to get to this stream. That was really eye-opening to me. And to see the project that we put in, plus the latrines, that's a total game changer. People don't see that stuff. People just see Adam Wainwright. I got to see the human side of it and, and he's a great human being. So that's why I was grateful for him to, for him to do that. To see the before and after pictures and, and hear the results, the waterborne illness almost all the way gone in six months, they can actually go out and try to, to thrive. When Mauricio was 15 years old, he made a tough decision to leave Honduras and his family for an uncertain future in America. Connecting with a Christian baseball mission called Impact, he was invited to play baseball and attend school in California. In two seasons at Capital Christian High School in Sacramento, he batted 509 and was drafted by the Boston Red Sox. After stints with the Red Sox, Giants, and Brewers, he was traded to the Houston Astros. You know, grew up in a, in a very tough environment, but I think that's the reason I got to the big leagues. I think that's the reason I'm able to have success. In the fall classic of November, 2022, Mauricio and the Astros defeated the Philadelphia Phillies, making Mauricio the first Honduran-born player to become a World Series champion. The next year, in June of 2023, the Houston Astros traveled to St. Louis for an interleague matchup against the Cardinals. This was the first time that Mauricio would get to meet Adam, and Adam would learn about the impact he had made in Mauricio's community in Honduras years ago. But I was so nervous to talk to him just because, you know, it's Adam Wade, right? Future Hall of Famer. And I told the club, I wait here as long as you want me to wait, but I want to talk to him and let him know about, about the water mission he did in Honduras and tell him thank you personally, just because it's pretty, pretty special. So I just pitched against the Astros and I just got my tail handed to me. And then I get a text from the clubhouse manager over there, Rip Rowe, and he said, hey, Mauricio wants to come over and talk to you and meet you and get you to sign a jersey. Is that okay? And I was like, yeah, I mean, you know, rub it in, why don't you? And uh, he came over and he shared the story about how, how much that water project had, me had meant to him and his community and his life um, and then how had that inspired him uh, as a person, as, as a humanitarian. I think what he did was wake something inside of me that, you know, Al Wainwright has been doing it for, for a while now and why I cannot do it. So I started serving more and more to my community, doing a lot of different stuff. I walked back into the clubhouse after giving a big hug, signing a jersey to him, telling him thank you. And I walked back in the, and I thought, you know what? Man, this is all for something. You know, it's not just the outs we're getting on the field. There's a, there's a lot more things that are happening off the field because of this game. When people see Honduras now, when people see me, I want them to associate Honduras with something good. You know, Honduras, yeah, it's bad, but that's the place I grew up. Um, I was, that's the cars that I was dealt with. And I think thanks to Honduras, I was able to shape the man I am today. It would be crazy powerful to see what we could do in this world. We could probably eliminate the world's water crisis if every Major League Baseball player got behind that cause. This is a story of two men who have made generous and courageous choices 
ultimately leading to their lives intersecting at a Major League Baseball game. Adam from rural Georgia and Mauricio from rural Honduras. Their stories teach us that true success is not just measured by the outcomes between a pitcher and a hitter in competition, but by the compassion shown between two people.